Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel and if you are new here, my name is Tay and you're watching Tay Budgets. I know you guys haven't seen me in a long, long, long time but baby, I wouldn't say I'm back but I've started school and it's just been a lot for me. While I have not been on camera, I've still been budgeting. Not as much as I should, but I've still been budgeting and saving. A lot has changed from the last video that you guys have seen. If you guys keep up with my channel, that is not consistent. A lot has changed. I think the last video that I did was my Tay Budgets Saving Challenges video. Um, this book is available on my Etsy account. I'll link my Etsy down below in the description box. You guys can go ahead and shop my Etsy. I only have this book up there available right now to buy, but soon I'll be putting more products up there so you guys can purchase. So I did, you know, do a kind of thorough video of what this book offers and what it's about and everything. So you guys can go ahead and purchase this book on my Etsy account. But that's not what this video is about today. This video is about cash stuffing. I love cash stuffing. I love watching cash stuffing videos. I've literally been trying to figure out different ways to save money and different ways how to make money and different ways how to stuff money in. It's, it's just literally been a lot over the past few months of me not being active on this uh, channel. But I am back for now so let me just give you guys a little rundown of before we get uh, into our cash stuffing so i recently started first semester of nursing school and being that i was low income before but now like i have to work less in order to put more time into studying and you know being a uh nursing student because when you're a nursing student you can't really work a lot because maybe if you work a lot then where's the time for studying and we want to put as much studying as we can because at the end i know it's going to pay off so right now i'm a low 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 income budgeter but we're not going to be claiming low for long um i just believe that greater is coming and i'm gonna be blessed soon i mean i'm blessed already but i'll be blessed to not call myself a lower in low income um low income you know person student i'll be middle to high income very very soon okay so now we're gonna get right into this cash stuffing if you have not subscribed subscribe so you guys can be a part of my lovely family and we're gonna get right into this stuffing okay all right so what i've started to do recently is do this little breakdown you guys can't see I started to do this little breakdown of what I have and how much I need to put into the binders I also started to do a monthly a monthly budget like each month I put in a different amount that I want to save and then I also started to do like my annual binder high um, priority low priority and my challenges so I have a binder for all what what is this five of these different things so this is I also changed my um, my binders if you guys have been keep, keep, keeping up with my channel i changed my binders from the last time you guys seen i had like you know like i had like tape budgets and stuff on there i'm just like i just want to be minimal simple straight to the point i don't have trackers in there i want to put trackers but it's just like i'm not going to keep up with the tracker so it doesn't make any sense for me to to put a tracker in there i'm just keeping it real with myself and then this this is my high priority um this is my low priority this is my annual binder like things that i have to pay um over the course of like months so like phone bill gas car insurance and this is my monthly savings binder and i also do like a month ahead as well i started a month ahead because i seen it i think it's on uh baddies and budgets i seen it that she had a month a lot of people have month ahead binders and so i'm like okay that's a good binder to have I'm not always going to be stuffing $100 in my binders and stuff like that, but I'm going to stuff what I have. And then last, my black binder. I kept this binder that I had from the beginning of my budgeting journey. Um, but this is now my challenges binder. Challenge, challenges. Like my different challenges that I did or am doing. So I've created some challenges that I want to do for myself. I also picked up some stickers from the dollar store um, because instead of me directly marking on my my um 
sheets. I made these sheets myself, these challenges myself. So this is Crocs and Scrubs. So it's one to 30. And then, you know, as I'm doing it, I'm putting the stickers on the, the what I'm completing. And then I have like different challenges in this, in this thing. So this one, I, girl, I had to reuse this one. So yeah, and this is my $1. This is, I think I'm doing $100 savings but i just have that extra hundred there just because everything is not going to be getting stuff today because you know like i said low income i don't even know how much i'm stuffing i think i'm stuffing if i'm not mistaken 570 so i'll be stuffing 570 today 570 today plus um an extra 10 so yeah let's get into this and it's already six minutes in i'm gonna be giving this to you guys raw i'm not even gonna edit it um because i feel like you guys deserve a video from me because i haven't been here in so long okay so first we're gonna start off with our annual binder which holds our bills cell phone credit card debt gas insurance miscellaneous tides car maintenance and laundry how did i get that so fast because it's written here okay so um for bills Everything is not going to be getting stuff. I think it's only going to be my annual binder and my high priority binder getting stuff today because I only got 570 to go around. So let's skip out on bills for now. Let's come back and see like if we have something for bills later on. So in cell phone, we are going to be adding a $10 bill. Okay. Um, I'm with T-Mobile, by the way. <laughs> y'all don't care. Do y'all care? Y'all don't care. So this is 20, 30, 35, 40, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. $46. I think my phone bill is like 48. Like made with T-Mobile, it kind of changes every now and then. And I also have a, um, a, a family plan that I'm a part of. A credit card. Credit card is going pretty good. I do have to pay back a good amount. So I want to stop using my credit card. I also have some coins in here too and then at the end i think i'm gonna empty out my wallet i don't think my wallet has anything in there though so credit card will be getting today 100 dollars my only hundred okay so it has one two three four five six hundred uh 20 40 60 80 680 85 uh Oh girl, 85, 90, 95, uh, 700, 05, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 7, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61. So 761. And then I have some cents in here um like having a tracker is very important because i wouldn't have to do that i would be just checking it over but for right now i can't deal with the tracker because like sometimes i don't even remember to write how much i have so i'm just being realistic with myself at this point um next is debt debt is going to be getting today five dollars um i wanted to do this for like student debt and stuff but girl i don't even know at this point so 10 this is 20 21 22 so that has 22 dollars why does it have 22 dollars i don't know but girl i, don't know. I, I really pray pray to death strength in jesus name amen gas gets 20 dollars. gas has been really doing good i don't even know how it has this much money but gas has really been doing good uh so we have 100 120 140 145 46 47 48 49 50 51 52 53 54 55 56 57 58 59 60 61 so 161 gas has 161 and then on top of that guys gas has went down so and i don't have a lot of places to go anymore as before so you know gas gas is being saved in my car and i'm really you know over the roof excited okay i don't have to be buying gas every week i can go like two weeks um even past my payday without 
getting gas and i'm just very excited about that so next we're going to go over into our insurance so i just paid my insurance actually so we're going to be starting from scratch so insurance is going to get 40 dollars. my insurance is 80 dollars a month yes 80 dollars a month so next i only have to put 40 more dollars you know to get you know past you know you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Child, anyways. Next is miscellaneous. Miscellaneous is getting $20. Of course, I'm going to take this out and put it into my wallet. $20. Okay. So miscellaneous now has $25, $26, $27, $20, $20 $29 $29 in miscellaneous. I'm trying to not buy things that I just don't need. Like, at this point, like, I'm really trying to budget very very i'm trying to go on a strict budget to the point where i'm just like yeah uh, yeah so i have not been going into the church building of recent because of circumstances beyond our control but i've been saving my tithes so when we do get back into the not the horn so when we do get, get so when we do get back into the actual building i can just um give my tithe so it's going to be getting 69 dollars today so 60 65 and then four ones they've been giving me some burnt of ones in the in the bank i'm just like what happened okay so 69 50 60 65 66 67 68 69 let me turn these ones around okay so i don't need to count my tithes I'm gonna give them. I'm gonna give it all together when that time comes. I'm not gonna separate it because I'm not even gonna remember how much I had to give each week. Okay, next is car maintenance. Car maintenance is getting $5. Okay, 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. If you guys hear noise, I live in a Caribbean household, so y'all know how that works. If y'all don't know how that works, maybe then I'll tell y'all. I'll tell y'all one day. Next is water. So they didn't have laundry, so I had to use water to substitute laundry, but I know what it is. As long as I know what it is, that's all that matters. So water is getting $10. I actually plan on going to the laundry this week. Um, I hope this is enough. I think I have enough on my laundry card too. So this is 20, 25, 26, 27. And then I think, I'm, I think all my binders are getting an extra $2. What I like to do is give all my binders an extra $2. You know, just to make sure all my binders get something at least. You know, because $2 is something. It's better than nothing. Okay, so we're gonna move on from our annual binder onto our high priority. High priority doesn't have a lot. First is birthday. Birthday is getting five dollars today. My birthday is March 9th, so I have a good amount of time before my birthday to save some big bucks because I plan on doing something really nice for myself for my birthday next year if God spares life. Next is my car. I'm trying to save for a new car, y'all. I'm tired of you know. Bigger and better is coming. So my car is getting $50 today. So how much is... So I'm saving in two places for my cars. So I have this binder here that goes... Yes, I made this binder, y'all. I don't make these binders, though. I don't make these binders because they're kind of hard to make. Let me tell y'all, resin is a lot. But that's not what this video is about. This binder holds all of these challenges. So I am doing the $20,000 challenge and this is it. So, so far I've been doing pretty good, pretty, pretty good. So instead of me doing like 20,000, I just transfer over the money that I have in this envelope, my car envelope to that envelope when it gets to a certain amount. So for right now, car has three, Four, four twenty, four forty, four sixty, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, seventy, seventy-one, seventy-two, seventy-three, seventy-four, seventy-five, seventy-six, oops, seventy-seven, seventy-eight, seventy-nine, eighty. Seventy-six, seventy-eight, seventy-nine, eighty. 
One, two, three, four. 480. Yes, it has four. This is 480. So I'll be transferring over soon when I get to 500 dollars. Okay, next is my emergency fund. I've been dipping into my emergency fund lately, guys, but chow girl i'm trying because i'm doing also a challenge in my challenges binder which is a emergency fund which will help me to save a thousand dollars i was supposed to have been hit a thousand but you know like i said before i'm dipping into my emergency fund which I, which i don't like but you know it is what it is anyways emergency today is getting twenty dollars yes that's small but it's something so 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 49 50 51 52 53 54 55 dollars in emergency i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna start I'm gonna start my emergency fund over and I'm gonna transfer this money. What was it? What was the number? I don't even remember. I guess we have to count again. Um, so let me just take out my challenge for this. This is my $1,000 emergency fund. Um, so we did month one, I started in August. So we saved $150. And then month two, which is September, we're going to save $125. So, so far, I have $25 for one, two, three, four, five. I have $25 for this month. So, the $25 is down. So, I only need 100 more. And right here, I think we said we had 50 I don't even know. Let's check again. Let's just, let's just do a round check and see what we have. Okay. So, 20, 40, 45. 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80. We have $80. So, not 1,000% good at math. So, we have $80. So we just need 45 more dollars to complete the month. So that should be good enough. That should be good enough. Um, so that is an emergency fund. We're just gonna transfer that over to make life easier for ourselves. So that'll be going in the front of emergency fund. So we need 45 more dollars to complete the month. And then we'll be moving on over to November. Cause this, no, 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 we'll be moving over to October, sorry. Cause we're in September right now and then October is 175. Hopefully, oof. Cause we wanna, I wanna build up my emergency fund. Like this, this is crazy. Like literally crazy, 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 crazy. So that's for that. And we can't put a sticker yet because we didn't complete the month. So we only put stickers when we complete the month. Okay, so emergency basically didn't get anything, but it did get something. It'll get $2 at the end of the day. So next is personal. The personal is gonna be getting $10 today. Okay, so 20, 21, 22, and 23. Okay, so my camera is near dying. So we have to move on to our savings. I've been taking a lot out of savings too. I'm not gonna lie to you, but I save better in cash than I do on my card. Oh girl. Chow. Anyways, savings is gonna be getting twenty dollars today. So 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 90, 91. We don't even have a hundred dollars in saving, baby. But it's okay, it's okay. Give ourselves some grace. Okay, next is vacation. Yes. So I recently went on a vacation. If you guys don't know, you guys can go over to my main channel, which is Shawnee with the T. I'll try to link it in the description box down below. I went on a vacation. If you guys want to know where I went, you guys just go on over to my main channel and it'll be literally the first video that you see when you click on videos because I recently just posted it. So I used the money that was in my vacation binder to go on my vacation. And I also use my Tay Budget Saving Challenges book that's on my Etsy to save up for vacation as well. 
So I'll be doing the same thing again this um, vacation around. So today vacation is going to be getting $50. So 50, 70, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101. So our first 100 down in vacation. So what I'm also going to do, we're going to go right back over to our... Um, Binder. We can open up vacation and vacation had how much again? 50, 70, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. It had 101. Instead of we can put this one dollar back in vacation in this binder and then we can get our stickers. Guys, if you hear somebody, if, if you hear people talking. It is what it is at this point. So we're gonna be doing two fifties. So a fifty and another fifty. And then that's a hundred. So we put our dollar back in here so and then we can put the money that we have for vacation in here. I don't know how much this is this adds up to, but we gonna know at the end when it's done. I literally sat here and I drew all of these little uh challenges challengings guys i don't know how to say that word challenges up because i was just feeling you know like being creative so that's what i did all right next what do we have we have our wedding am i getting married no but i have a feeling that in the next few years something will happen listen y'all don't gotta be getting married to save for it okay y'all better start saving from now especially because i know i'm extra girl y'all better start saving this thing again fifty dollars on today okay all right so 50 70 90 guys i don't know how to count 110 115 120 125 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69. We're about to hit 170, y'all. Yeah, this could pay for a plate or two. What y'all think? It could pay for a chocolate fountain? Not even. But we getting up there. We're gonna have to do a, um, the twenty the twenty thousand dollar challenge for this thing right here. All right. So we're moving from our high priority binder to oh okay. I guess we can start putting um two dollars in each binder. I will not be doing that on camera because it is very time consuming i do want a smaller wallet i got this wallet for christmas i'm gonna be emptying my coins might as well just make the video make the video worth watching so i'll just be emptying my coins and putting it into my uh coin jar which is adding almost adding up to two to um three hundred dollars which i'm so proud of and i'm gonna just be putting the new amount into my wallet which is three dollars worth of coins all right okay cool i i also want to show you guys um my something that i also created I'm just gonna wait let me add these coins first let me just show you that look at this look at this it is let me see it's almost hitting 300 it is at 228.24 can you guys see that 228.24 baby I cannot wait to change this out y'all and when I change it out I'm gonna put it into something that I'm gonna show you guys very soon so I'm gonna go ahead and put all these coins into my jar and then I'll be back with you guys to end this video, okay? Okay, so I just filled my corn jar. So we are now at 2.30, what an accomplishment, guys. Yes, I can't wait to take this to the bank. This is, wow, this, wow. I don't even remember when I got this, 
but it's beautiful if you guys do not have this you guys need to go ahead on amazon and get one of these um self counter jars which is a piggy bank i see a dollar right here and i see another dollar okay well that's not important what i wanted to show you guys was something that i made out of a shoe box and it's called the mystery money drop so i drop money in here every time i you know have random money somebody's beeping outside and then i've also put the date on the back when i started so i started august 20th 2022 and i just would drop money in here every time so i do have something to drop yeah so i'll be dropping that in so there's one. i don't know how much money in is in here that's why it's called the mystery money drop y'all am i gonna be putting the full 10 we need to put something in five we actually do need to put something in all right so i'll be looking at this oh i see a 50 can y'all see i got a 50 in there oh snap i do want to see how much i have i don't know if i want to i'm not gonna do it i'm not gonna open it december i'm probably gonna open it i don't even know what i'm gonna open it honestly um but this is what i wanted to show you guys because i thought it was just so cute um i also i'm still doing the one dollar challenge i don't think i told you guys but you guys seen in my challenges binder i had like a one dollar challenge going on this is also a part of the one dollars challenge uh i also hit some money in here y'all because you know it's always a big surprise to me to find money in here i did hide a hundred in here and i also hit a 20 somewhere i don't even remember where i hit it i have so many ones in here this bag doesn't even close anymore so i'll be counting that hopefully at the end of the year so thank you guys so much for watching my battery is gonna die make sure you guys remember to like comment and subscribe turn your post notifications and if you like this video please give this video a big thumbs up bye thank you for watching peace